play is about love and the play is about forgiveness and tolerance yeah. and how you can go through a valley, a shadow time together yeah. and hopefully keep your hope and keep your, uh, keep your bond even if the bond has changed. And depression's tough and confusing, especially for somebody who is dealing with a loved one who has depression. I think the play exposes a lot of that because a lot of the dialogue comes from a place of love, but love that doesn't necessarily help the person who is depressed. Like, why don't you just get up and take a shower? Why don't you have some food? Why don't you do something? And it's not the way depression works. Janie, who is Dan's wife, is dealing with her own depression and trying to communicate that to her husband who deals with people who are depressed and having the worst day of their life. And she's trying to explain that she's not having a good time and that she's hurting. On some level, I feel like he, he's unwilling to admit that that sort of instability is here at home. Like, no, 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 I deal with, I deal with unstable people all day long. This is, you're not unstable. Mm -hmm. We're okay, we're okay. So he's sort of got this, this idea that home is okay, people that he deals with on a daily basis are not okay. And so in that way, there's difficulty in hearing and understanding. Is this the way to go? Am I making the right decisions when he can't make them and yet he's an adult? And am I making too many decisions? Am I helicoptering or being overly vigilant? And as a parent, I think we're hardwired to our kids. Yeah. So it's very hard to see someone suffer and not actually suffer with them. He's my cub. Yeah. <laughs> it's my surrogate cub. Yeah.